All right, welcome back. You know, when we develop as people an illness or when there's something that goes wrong, naturally you go to the doctor. Well, that too extends to the life of one particular goldfish. Local 15 web content specialist, Taryn Reed, you have the story trending around the web right now. Tell us more, ma'am. Well, it started when 10-year-old George the goldfish started to develop a tumor near his head. So his owner, Pip Joyce, knew something had to be done. So he took George to the vet to have the tumor removed. George was sedated in a bucket and the operation operation to remove his tumor took 45 minutes. The fish was having trouble eating, getting around, getting bullied by the other, the other fish. And then closing up was, did prove quite difficult because there wasn't much skin to work with. So we managed to close half of it up with, with some sutures, just you know, standard sutures, really small ones, um, and then had to seal it off with some, some tissue glue. You know, we love George. He's been great company and he's, we've had some good laughs out of him. George was returned to the bucket after the surgery with painkillers where he had to stay for a few days. But Pip says he was jumping and moving around pretty soon, which is a good sign. George is expected to live for 20 more years. Well, Lucky George. The size of the goldfish and the fact that he is big enough to even have a tumor. And wow. George, George has no idea. He's so lucky. <laughs> he is so loved. You know, mm -hmm. the, uh, thank you. Yes. I, where else but around the web right. could we go for this one?